Income inequality, by definition, refers to the extent to which income is distributed in an uneven manner among a population. Panama has several problems of poverty, malnutrition, and inequality despite its relatively high income per capita. According to the World Bank, over 1 million individuals live below the poverty line, meaning 37%, and over half a million of these, being 19%, live in extreme poverty. This signals the fact that Panama has a very large gap between the wealthy and the poor. According to the CIA World Factbook, Panama has the second worst income distribution in Latin America. It has a consumption genie of 49 and an income genie of 60. Panama is on par with Brazil and just below South Africa, two of the most unequal countries in the world. Poverty levels in Panama vastly vary depending on geographic area. There are three main areas, the rural areas, which poverty is highly concentrated, the indigenous sectors, where poverty levels are described as abysmal, and the urban sector, not as widespread or deep, but still very noticeable. Human capital investment is also a factor that contributes highly to income inequality in Panama. The more a person has invested in acquiring knowledge, the more likely it is that they will have a higher paying job. As human capital consists of investment of time, it also consists of investment of money that many do not have the opportunity to pursue. The national government has devised plans to attempt to shorten the inequality gap consisting of better education programs, better health care, and more policy enforcement so employee discrimination is not as large of an issue. Other policies that should be taken into account by the government would be reallocating public expenditure, higher monitoring of poverty levels and the sectors that are affected the most, and working with technological advances to better the situation.